title fight between Bruce Lee and Jan Blachowicz. Well, for a long time, he's been mentioned with the baddest men on the planet. For a long time, though, the title fight eluded him. Not anymore. Here he is, the number one heavyweight contender, finally making this walk and cracking a smile. He's waited a long time for this. He's not expecting a 25-minute war. He believes he has the power and the skills to get this thing done quickly. I guess we'll find out. So here he is making his way to the Octagon for another heavyweight title defense. This has been the baddest man on the planet now for several years, and he has taken on all comers more often than not, leaving them twitching on the canvas, knockout power for days. The question is tonight, with a challenge like this, can he walk out the way he came in as the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world? for this heavyweight championship fight. More than five years apart, with big differences in height, but some differences in reach. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Bergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Heavyweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a Muay Thai fighter, holding a professional record of 27 wins, 8 losses. He stands 6 feet 2 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Warsaw, Poland, presenting the challenger, Jan Blakowicz. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting at Los Angeles, California. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, this is for the UFC Championship. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, come out your corners, come out fighting. You ready? You ready? Let's go, guys, fight. Line, Las Vegas, Nevada. This is the fight that in the world. With respect to anywhere else you want to go, if I'm a fighter, if I'm an athlete in combat sports, this is where I want to compete. You want to fight in Vegas, and now this beautiful T-Mobile Arena is the backdrop for tonight's great UFC event. Oh, really using his reach advantage there with that land, DC. Oh, nice punch there by Guajovic. Just missed with the straight left hand. Continues to mix it up. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press it. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Ooh. He needs to start looking at the finish now because he's got it on the hurt very bad. <laughs> Stuck.
stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Oh, nice job by him to get the knee to the target there, using his length exceptionally well tonight. Effective punch there by Blahovich. Over and over, he's landed these big body kicks. Midway through round one. Right hand upstairs. Big kick land. While the body was wide open, his opponent took advantage. Kick to the body lands flush. He's going to have to make some adjustments here moving forward. So just over 20 total strikes have already landed for Jan Wachowicz. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Under two minutes to go. And they set. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Beautiful counter punch. Really settling in when it comes to his counter attack here tonight. And again, making good use of what is a huge advantage in reach. Oh, and he lands yet another flush knee. That's going to leave a mark. And again, when you're using this length as effectively as he is here tonight, we might get a finish here in the not-too-distant future. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Blahovich. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. That was a thudding leg kick. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. Just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near-perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout. So on the sport's biggest stage, he comes up large. The baddest man on the planet, the UFC heavyweight champion of the world, your winner and by knockout here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliana has called a stop to this contest at 4 minutes, 29 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon. All right, so we hear and still tonight, our UFC heavyweight champion came in with a lot of pressure, a lot of hype, and he successfully defends the title here tonight. With all that pressure, he never changes his approach. He always does exactly what he says he's going to do.